Hello, hello. We're back for more Harry Potter Hogwarts. You know the whole thing. Haven't played this in a hot minute, so as usual, probably gonna be rusty. But before we actually look into yada yada whatever. Oh, do I have more of these? No, okay. I am planning on every single Friday uploading this until we finish it. We still have quite a bit left in this. I'm not sure exactly how many episodes it's gonna be, but I really enjoy playing this and I think we just need to play through it, get it done, whatever, and then we'll move on to something different and we can decide what that's gonna be when the time comes. But for now, we're gonna do this. And while we're here, I'm also gonna say, Tuesdays, I'm going to be uploading Stardew Valley, and then Fridays, I'm going to be uploading this, Hogwarts Legacy, and we'll see how it goes, and if we need to make changes, we'll make changes, but with that being said, now that all the announcements are taken care of, let's see where we left off. <gasps> ooh, 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 where did that go? Where did that go? Where did that go? Well, we got another one of those done. I don't remember seeing how many of those we had left, but hey, we're making progress, so good enough for me. Oh, what is this? Lumos. What? That is the crustiest pixelated looking picture I've ever seen. There we go. <laughs> okay, let's just start doing... What is this one? I could probably do this one, because it's just practicing flying. And while we're on the topic... I unlocked a broom. I don't know how I did it. I just opened it. I somehow opened the game and then it was there. Holy, she wants me to go all the way down there. There is still so much stuff I have. Oh, I think they updated the map. I feel like this stuff did not used to be there. Okay, let's see if I can remember how to fly. Oh, it like glows. Oh, it glows purple and pink. Oh my goodness. Oh, there was a flu flame down here. Okay, I forgot how to be. Ah, ha, ha, ha. I think like a stone. Wait, what is happening? Why is she? What did I just stumble into? Why do I always run into the weirdest side quests? Why okay. Did I never learn how to swim? Okay, no. So it's nothing bad. She just doesn't know how to swim. <laughs> let's let's help her out. Going Him, her. I don't know. Goodness, no. Though I'm beginning to think I really should learn how to swim. Can't very well be liaison to the mer people if I don't know how to swim. You're a liaison to the mer people? Well, not technically, no. At least not yet. Huh? The position doesn't actually exist at the moment, but I have a plan to change that. I'm Nerida, by the way. Nerida Roberts. We didn't officially meet, but we jeweled in the crossed ones club. Wait, what? Yes, of course. Good to see you again. I destroyed and her. You, you seem quite interested in me. Maybe not. People. I don't know. I am. And they're as misunderstood and disregarded by wizard kind as goblins and centaurs are. I feel that if goblins and centaurs have liaison officers at the ministry, then the mer people should have one too. Okay. I'm impressed. I think reaching out to the mer people is a grand idea. You do? Oh, thank you. Of course, I haven't exactly done anything just yet. I presented them with a gift a few weeks ago, and they wanted to leave me one as well, in one of their caves. Reciprocity and an offer to visit. I tried telling them I couldn't swim, but I'm afraid that bit got lost in translation. Mermish really is tricky. How has Wizardkind fallen short in its treatment of mer people? Well, we've consistently deigned mer people as being beneath us despite the many similarities between our cultures. One can hardly blame them for declining being status by the ministry years ago. Who are we to classify those of such beauty and intelligence? Okay. What do you imagine oh, what the music the mer people would do? Oh, so many things. I want to know everything I can about them. After I've mastered swimming, I perfect my mermish, of course. And I'd share with them anything they wanted to know about wizard kind. <laughs> my hope is that by understanding each other better, both of our societies could grow. Okay, but I, why though? What is it about the mer people that interests you so much? 
I can't begin to tell you how brilliant they are. I mean, rumor is that tales about them have infiltrated even the muggle world. The oldest known mer people, sirens, come from Greece. And of course, Scotland has selkies and Ireland is home to Merrows. I could go on for ages about them. Their glorious underwater communities, domestication of sea life, their art and music. It's a travesty how little is understood about them. Okay. Why, why do I feel like the side quests in this are the most random thing? Well, I can swim and could help you if you'd like. You'd really do that? Oh, thank you. Thank you, thank you. The last thing I want is for them to think I shunned their gift. Diplomacy is a delicate dance. Now, if I'm not mistaken, I think you can dive down to their cave from just there in the water. Okay, I cannot believe that I am just willing to randomly jump in I random can't water. I hear about what you find. One day soon, I'll see for myself. Jump in water. Oh my god, it. girl, stop. Jump in water for someone I barely even know. Like... I'm just like, oh yeah, you know, why not? Let's go. No. Like, I, okay, in real life, I can't swim either. So I obviously wouldn't do this for someone. But even if I could, no. Not happening, they can figure it out themselves. They're also called the leaky caves. All right, diving. Okay, oh. They're kind of snazzy caves though. Luke, now then, I'll need you to come with me. Here, wait. Lumos. So can I just do one at a time? Hold on, where am I supposed to bring them? I think I- oh, okay. Pff, I got a little too eager. Now for the rest of you. Yep. Boom. Ooh. What do we have in here? Then? Wow. What is it? Nerida will be happy about Ooh. this. Mermish artifact. That looks cool. That was easy. That was like one of the easiest side quests we've had. I'm back. I got your mermaid necklace. Oh, I'm stuck on some rocks. Hold on. Don't mind me. Your gift from the mer people was exactly where they said it would be. Oh, that's wonderful news! I was so worried I'd left it too long and they'd seen it as a slight. Our relationship with them is already so tenuous. I've decided and to keep I'm glad it. We <laughs> have to foster some healthy diplomatic relations. Merlin's beard. It's marvelous. I'm going to show it to everyone, including the ministry. Should I hand deliver it or send by owl? Thank you again so much. You may have just helped improve relations between wizard kind and mer people for decades to come. Okay, but girl, how do I you? I can't wait to study this. <laughs> okay. Well, anyways, um, let's continue on to our other objective. There we go. Okay. There's something funky over here. I'm gonna do a little spin. Oh, there's one of these! Okay. Let's see what's up your sleeve this time, Merlin. Yeah. This. Oh, okay, so it's one of the... Revelio. There's more over there. These. Right here. Okay, dead one. <laughs> that one just flew to my face. <laughs> you can go now, yeah. Up there. Hey. <gasps> oh! What? <gasps> oh. It's dupe. What? Hold on. <laughs> Did we just run into what I think we ran into? What is this? The patient's symptoms include pockmarked skin of greenish hue, sparks sneeze from the nostrils, and gr oh my gosh. 
and a green and purple rash between the toes. Textbook case- why can't I talk? Textbook case of dragon pox, possibly lethal. I have prescribed a second dose of the gorse more cure, but it may not be sufficient. As such, I have further prescribed an elixir to induce euphoria. To ease the patient's probable passing, must sanitize my equipment, highly contagious. Are they dead? I'm sorry, I did not- oh, I just stepped on her. I am so sorry. Well, I feel- I feel bad. Okay, we're just gonna- we're gonna take these and we're gonna get out of here. <laughs> Sorry. Did I finish it? I did. Yay! Okay. Another one of these checked off the list. Uh, got a little traumatized on the way, but hey. What is this place? What is this? <gasps> oh, this is a bad thing. There's a lot of enemies here. What is this? Ah! Ah! Oh my goodness! Should I just take him out really quick? Look at how many there are! Oh, you're weak. Oh. What did I just do? <laughs> Portego! Oh no! <laughs> ah! Hold on. Did I just tell you <laughs> I just. I'm gonna say we bat. Oh, well, I'm gonna search this. And I'm gonna come back to this another time, because something tells me I'm not quite strong enough yet to do that. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Okay, okay, okay. I'm telling you to stop, so stop. Jeez. Oh my god, I just... <laughs> okay, boom, did I... Ooh! I just almost took myself out. Well, let's return to uh, whoever her name is. Get this- why don't I just- hold on. I'm gonna be smart about this for once and um, use the flu flames I unlock. Oh my god, we have so much of this game left. Hey! Welcome back. Have you finished your assignments? Yes, I did. Reporting back, Professor. Assignments all finished. Well done. Shows good discipline. Wisdom is a golden snitch, as they say. And you're proving a skilled seeker in that regard. Let us practice a restore momentum. A charm, incidentally, created to stop quaffles from plummeting straight to the ground during a Quidditch match. Oh. Precise Oof. Okay. movements. On it. Ah, I messed it up. Still not very good at that, but we kill, get it done. I don't know what words just came out of me. Okay. Smell as much as possible. That's it. Keep it up. Cool. So now that there's a glitching in the sky, do you have anything else to say? Professor, do you have a moment? Yes. What is it? In class, I heard you mention the Toyohashi Quidditch team. I did. The Toyohashi Tengu are from Japan, dominant, known for their rigorous training. They practice near the Mahutokoro School of Magic, often battling both tempestuous seas and violent storms in addition to each other. Tournament play is almost always easier for the Tengu than their training sessions. I take it Whoa. you're a fan. Fan? <laughs> I was being groomed to play on their team. And I would have been a Tengu, if not for a bit of bad luck. Oh? I know that feeling. Some things are simply out of our control. Mm, and some things are in it. I should have known better. I made my own luck. What does that mean? I was betrayed by someone I trusted. Myself. I did not see clearly and I paid a dear price. 
What did she do? My what best happened? My Asuka and I were being groomed to play on the team together. I as keeper and she as chaser. She was breathtaking. She once corkscrewed through three players and scored before they even turned their heads. But as trials for the Tengu got closer, she panicked. I did not realize the extent of her panic until it was too late. Wait. She wanted so desperately for both of us to play together that she had slipped Felix Felicis into our tea before we were to show them our skills. Oh. I'm not sure what that is. <laughs> what is Felix Felicis? A potion. Also known as liquid luck. And it is illegal in all wizarding sports. I knew within minutes that something was different. I had never played so well. And Asuka was playing more beautifully than I had ever seen. When I confronted her afterwards, she admitted what she had done. I withdrew from consideration immediately. Oh. But it wasn't your fault. You didn't know about the potion in the tea. It does not matter. My flying that day was not my own. I could not live with myself. So I withdrew and explained to them why. I burned my broom in disgrace. Oh. What happened to Asuka? Did she burn her broom as well? Asuka played for the Tengu for two oh. seasons. You didn't report her? Tell them what she'd done. Her fate was not mine to decide. My fate is in my hands. <laughs> the book. As your fate is in yours. Thank you, Professor. I shall remember what you've told me. Okay. Well, I didn't expect that. Okay, next. Grow and harvest fluxweed. Acquire all three combat plants and use them simultaneously. What are the combat plants? Uh, speaking of that, though, we are... We need to go to the Room of Transfiguration. That's what I wanted to s Oh no. No, no, no. Remove requirement. My bad. Okay, let's see. What do I already have? <gasps> wow. I already grew flex weed. What is this? Mandrake. Be proud of all the potions you've brewed. Thanks, Deek. No. Okay, first off, before we do anything else, I'm gonna use this. We have a bunch of Oh my god. Oh my god, what are those? <laughs> Hold on, we're trying that on. No way. <laughs> Those are ridiculous. Okay. Um, what also are... I don't know what just happened, but I did not mean to do it. Okay, hold on. So we need to get Mallow Sweet from the Magic Neep. We need to get the Chinese Chomping Cabbage from Dogweed and Death Cap. And then that is also from Dogweed and Deathcap. Okay, so basically what I'm hearing is we need to go back to Hogsmeade. This one does 15 minutes, so we're gonna do that. We're also gonna get the Mandrake going again. Yes, cool. Perfect. Now, what was the other... That's my bad. <laughs> Acquire and use an invisibility potion. Do I have the recipe for that? <sighs> well, I guess we're going back to Hogsmeade. I have both of the potion recipes I need now, but do I have what I need? Oh no. No. Uh, okay, well, we need troll. I'm assuming troll bogeys. I don't know. So we're going to look for that and we're going to do this one, which we already have to pull. So, so we can just do that. It's fine. This troll lair. Okay. Is there one closer? I'm nervous that the further out we go, the harder they're going to be. But we'll go try that one. And then right next to it is the small. Oh, it's small. Okay, cool. Okay, I don't know how difficult this is going to be, but hopefully I don't die. <laughs> Trying to finagle our way in here. <gasps> um, that troll is huge. That's what I have to fight? I almost just landed on his head. Oh no. He's level 21. I'm screwed. Yeah. 
I am in trouble. I don't know if I'm actually going to be able to do this. <laughs> Ow. Okay, well, he's under half now. We got this. I did it. That was way easier than I thought it was going to be. Collect these. Okay. That was fine. It wasn't f great, but it, it was okay. <laughs> Honestly, I would take that over the spiders. And we're gonna hope that whatever camp I'm stumbling onto is easy. And not one that's gonna make me want to die. <sighs> There's quite a few people here. Well, let's just do this. Oh my god, there's wolves? Whoa, okay, hold on. I am in a bad spot. Get the dog out of here. Oh my god, okay. <gasps> he turned into a dude. Yeah, this is not going good. Okay, this is fine. We're good. Okay. Cool. Oh, I forgot to use Depulso. That was the whole point of me doing this. It sounds like there's more people, so we should be fine. Did I do it? Oh! <gasps> oh my god! Wait! Oh, I'm so happy I know how to do this now. Okay, hold on. Yay! Okay, well, yeah, who decided that this was a good idea? Oh, oh! <laughs> Well, I did my part. What was that? That was a freaking spider, wasn't it? Wasn't it? <laughs> You're telling me I have to go in there? Oh, where did it go? Where did it go? Ooh. Is there more? Hmm, it looks like there is. Can I just fight all of them like this, please? Oh no. <gasps> oh, they're oh, they're babies. Okay, good. Well, they die from one hit, so that's fine. I'm not going in there. If you think I'm going in there, you're crazy. I might have to go in there. <laughs> Can I fly on top? Hold on, let me look down. Can I land on the wall? Hmm. Landing is unavailable. Of course it is. Okay. Well. <gasps> oh my god. <laughs> <gasps> yeah, no, I'm not going in there. Uh uh. Oh, they're all out here. Oh, they're all out here. They're all out here. They're all out here. They're all out here. Oh my god, they're jumping at me. They're jumping at me. They're jumping at me. They're jumping at me. I don't know where they are, but I'm just shooting things. Uh, 
Okay, it doesn't say there's anything else left in here, so... <gasps> Shut up. Oh my god. I don't think you guys understand how much I hate spiders. I am disgusted. Okay. Well, there was another camp really close to this one. Yeah, this one. So we'll go to that. And this time I promise I won't forget to use the pulso. I'll even stay on it this whole time. Okay, I did not anticipate having to... Oh, okay, well... It somehow got out. Oh, that was a jump scare. <laughs> I wasn't anticipating having to deal with spiders, and now I'm like... Oh, my God. Oh. Huh? Whoa. Oops. Oh. Who are these people? Well, they must be nice. Oh, hi. Did it. Okay. Cool. Where is the animal I need to free? Does it- <gasps> No! That is devastating. Well, in good news, um, we're done with this one, and then Professor Garlic should be done as soon as we go back to the room of requirement because because those have been growing now for a bit oops i'm going to the wrong place okay well in 12 minutes we can do this one because i forgot about that well in that case i think i'm gonna go we're gonna attend divination class bye deke bye deke oh this is where i'm going i don't think i've actually ever been up here oh I didn't, oh, whoa, what's happening? <laughs> what was that side eye for? What is happening? Ooh. Oh. <laughs> she thinks all these students are dumb, <laughs> just by her faces. What do we have here? Oh. I hope those assignments were challenging enough for you. There's I've a thing. All of my tasks, Professor Onai. Very well done. Although I must admit, I did have something of a premonition that you would follow through. Now, as you have no doubt sharpened your perception by completing my assignment, I am cured based upon what just the happened? knowledge that one's present and even one's past may reveal traces of what is to come. What do you see in your own future? Um, I would say power, but I feel like that's not the right thing to say. So I'm going to say triumph. That will be hardship. I'm sure of it. But I see triumph in the end. A measured perception. Very wise. Nothing worthwhile is ever easy. And that is why such futures are worth striving for. But this talk of tomorrow should not divert us from your present success. I shall inform our good deputy head. I don't know what is happening, why she is moving like that. <laughs> and if that performance is any omen of what your future may hold, then I for one see great things. Okay. Channel your magic <gasps> whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, I did it. I don't know why I wasn't prepared to do that. <laughs> I forgot that was part of it. Yay! You have it. Excellent. Oh. I think you have it. <laughs> okay, I kind of need to collect this though. So like, can you let it be dark? 
Professor, do you have a moment? I do. I was wondering how you decided to teach divination. Ah, the art of divination is an important yet often misunderstood branch of magic. Those of us who possess the sight are rare. And, as is often the case with the unique among us, we can frequently be misread, even feared. When I was granted the opportunity to teach others about my gift and the good it can do, I was most grateful. I see. Natty told me that you and she moved here from Uganda, where she had attended Wagadu. Yes. Natsai and I both loved Uganda and Wagadu, but we are happily settled here now. I had foreseen such a change, but did not know the details until it occurred. I was glad of the outcome. You would be wise to remember that the consequences of our actions are complex. And so, divining what is to come is not as simple as gazing into a crystal ball or studying the bottom of a teacup. What, what is it about the teacup? I find it truly intriguing, even if I don't fully understand it. <laughs> intriguing. That is one word for it. And I'm certain you will come to understand many things more deeply in the days ahead. You are a student at Hogwarts, after all. It cannot have escaped you that we in the wizarding world are forever navigating the seemingly inexplicable. Yeah, of course, Professor. Now, I know that we both have places to be. Not because I have the sight, mind you, but because I am a professor and you are a student. I have enjoyed our conversation. Okay, well, we're gonna have to remember to come get this little monkey thing, the moon. I'm probably gonna forget, but I'll do my best. Um, we're gonna try and do the other thing. If I would have just remembered to plant the dang... Whatever. Cabbages. I think I can brew one of the potions. Not that one. Yeah, the invisibility one. Okay. Okay. I have an invisibility potion. Next one is this one. A shrivel fig fruit in stent of the dead. Should I run? Well, we still have to wait for the other one to grow, so I might as well run to Hogsmeade again. Okay, can I gather this now? Oh, okay, we have a minute left. Perfect. So we're gonna run over here. Oh, I forgot. Twelve minutes! Okay, well, as long as it's growing, it's fine. <laughs> Yay! Okay, so now we just have to use all of them together. Right, hold on. Let me make sure it doesn't have to be against the enemy. <laughs> use them simultaneously. Can do. Uh... Oof. I got a little nervous. I figured maybe I was supposed to do the Mandrake one last since you can't do them, but I think I did it. I did. Okay. Perhaps a hybrid. Bouncing to- I finished the activities you assigned me, Professor Garlic. Wonderful. I hope you gained a greater appreciation for the flora in our lives. I am forever enraptured by it. Just yesterday, I spent hours pruning my self-fertilizing shrubs and flutterby bushes. Didn't realize how long I'd been at it until the sun began to set. Wow. Well, if there's one thing I love to see more than my plants thriving, it's one of my students doing the same. Now, ready to learn flippendo? Chin up, keep a light grip, and it's all in the wrist. Let's see you give it a go. I bet. You will want to focus with this spell. Nothing as mortifying as knocking back a colleague when all you wanted to do was move a few parts. Oh. Boom. What am I supposed to test it on? Oh. Oh. Just go spinning. Okay. Yikes. Professor Garlic, a moment of your time? The plants are resting, so now's as good a time as any. I was wondering, what made you want to teach herbology? How lovely of you to ask. I've always had an affinity for greenery, so this situation is a bit of a dream come true. After graduation, I was thrilled to be asked to step in for my old herbology professor. 
He'd had a slight accident, you see. Oh dear. A shame for him, but it worked out well for you. Well, he never cared. Really cared for the plants, and they could sense it. Oh, you'd be surprised how perceptive a plant can be. So did he get like eaten? Anyway, <laughs> the trouble began one day when he cut into a wigan tree. Huh? Unfortunately for him, its leaves were hiding a bow truckle. You oh. may recall the marvelous creatures that resemble a twig. The little beast gouged the professor's oh. eyes quite fiercely, oh. but terrifying, I'd imagine. Uh, likely for the professor too. And that's oh. when you took over as the herbology professor. Well, not quite. After three weeks at St. Mungo's, my predecessor regained a tiny bit of his eyesight. He insisted on returning to the greenhouse. Within a week, he had, he claims by accident, kicked a Chinese chomping cabbage. So it was back to St. Mungo's for oh him. Oh my lord. What a string of bad luck. Hmm. Well, I felt awful for him, but I dare say I felt a bit more sympathy for the cabbage. <laughs> Upon his discharge from the hospital, his indifference to plants had turned to utter disdain. He lost what little patience he had left with a particularly temperamental venomous tentacular and... Well, his resulting leave of absence continues to this day. So he did get eaten. I'm glad everything worked out as it did, and that you're the herbology professor now. Very kind of you to say. I do love these gardens and helping my students grow. Huh. Lovely speaking with you. Have a wonderful day. Okay. Oh, remember, be kind to your Wigan trees. Yes, I'm not trying to go blind like the one dude did. Well, on that note, we're gonna go to the common room. Okay, we're gonna put the last coin we got in here. Ta-da! All right, well, with that, we, <laughs> we experienced some things today I was not anticipating, but we got some of our little quests done. We're gonna save the main one until next time, I think, but we made some more progress. I think that's good enough here first day back getting the ropes again but hope you guys enjoyed had a good time and i will see you all next week bye